Good morning, brothers and sisters in Christ. Today's devotion is taken from The Desire of Ages by Ellen G. White, chapter 48, page 435. When Jesus told them that he was to be put to death and to rise again, he was trying to draw them into conversation in regard to the great test of their faith. Had they been ready to receive what he desired to make known to them, they would have been saved bitter anguish and despair. His words would have brought consolation in the hour of bereavement and disappointment. But although he had spoken so plainly of what awaited him, his mention of the fact that he was soon to go to Jerusalem again kindled their hope that the kingdom was about to be set up. This had led to questioning as to who should fill the highest offices. On Peter's return from the sea, the disciples told him of the Saviour's question, and at last one ventured to ask Jesus, Who is the greatest in the kingdom of heaven? Do you desire greatness alone? Are you waiting for the coming of Jesus only so that you can experience greatness? Let's pray. Lord, I know that soon Jesus will come again for the second time and establish his kingdom on this earth. But there are times where I long for the second coming of Christ only so that I can experience greatness and glory. Help me to realize that before greatness comes, sacrifice. Teach me to see that true greatness comes with sacrifice and help me to long to be like Jesus. Humble me and help me to put others before me. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. May you have a marvelous day ahead of you. Goodbye.